Hey everyone, King Baby here with more Nintendo news. I feel like that's all I'm reporting lately, but some big stuff happening in the past week. If you're not up to speed, basically Nintendo came out just about a week ago and said that they hit their third annual loss um, in a row, some big money. And then a few days ago, uh, Mr. Awada, the CEO of Nintendo, came out and said that he would be taking a 50% pay cut and along with other board of directors that they would be taking between 20 and 30% pay cut which I agreed upon. I, I think that's that's a good first step. So now Nintendo's coming out and they're exploring the op option of a merger. Um, now I've, I read a lot of your comments and you guys might be confused that um, a merger is not a sellout. I mean I don't want to talk business terms with you because it's boring but uh, basically what a merger is, is is two forces coming together to form you know uh, one company you know to basically up their strength uh, a lot of you guys said oh Sony's gonna buy out Microsoft I'm sorry Sony's gonna buy out Nintendo or Microsoft's gonna buy out Nintendo now there's no way that's gonna happen I'd be shocked um, especially Microsoft being that it's a Western company and Nintendo's an Eastern company that would be the least of options um, but things like you know Nintendo might you know merge with Capcom or Square Enix, or companies like that, or maybe even Disney, it's also possible, but um, basically I'm going to read this paragraph to you word for word, uh, it's not long, and just let you know basically what I interpret it as is. Um, Awada says that they're able to take hits on failures thanks to their large cash reserves it has built from previous strong earnings. Remember, Nintendo, uh, up, up until the past 30 years, they they've earned the past 30 years they, they are in the positive except for the last three he says because the entertainment industry's ebbs and flows and wild swings mister Yamauchi insisted that it's vital to have deep pockets um, basically Nintendo could afford to take a few more losses as the years come not that they want to um, without savings we could not have recovered from a single failure in game systems even now we can afford many options because of our robust financial standing yeah Nintendo this is an option guys I, I, I highly doubt you know obviously a buyout would not happen they're not even talking buyouts guys they're talking mergers and I don't even think a merger is gonna happen they're just exploring options and um, it's good that they are because they want to fix this problem right away but I trust me Nintendo can still afford to lose in the next few years not that they want to their business they want to grow but um Unless things really can continue to go downhill, I think Nintendo is here to stay. I am still concerned, don't get me wrong, but um, I think that Nintendo is going to be with us for quite a while. 